I want to start the next story by asking the viewers this question. If you had $56 billion, what would you do with all that money? Would you buy a house, a high rise or an island all for yourself? Would you keep some and donate the rest to charity? What does $56 billion even look like? Will you be satisfied if you earn that much money? You won't, you can't, because ordinary citizens like you and me struggle to keep a tight grip on our purse strings. But billionaires don't have to worry about that, you see. If a $56 billion paycheck is unimaginable for you, you are not alone. It is too much. And that is precisely what an American, American court has said. When they came to know how much Elon Musk makes at Tesla, on Tuesday, a court in Delaware ruled in favor of investors who challenged Musk's $56 billion pay package. The judges essentially ruled that his salary was excessive. For scale, Musk's paycheck is six times larger than the combined pay of 200 of the highest paid executives of 2021. The judges said that his compensation was inappropriately set by the Tesla board. And the court has now struck down his pay package. It has been voided. But Musk was brazen. Responding to the ruling, Musk said on the platform X, never incorporate your company in the state of Delaware. Now, if only the wealth divide could be solved by this sense of humor. The ruling comes five years after a shareholder lawsuit. It targeted the Tesla CEO Musk and the directors. They were accused of breaching their duties, which resulted in what has been described as waste of corporate assets. They say it led to unjust enrichment for Elon Musk. The plaintiffs argued the pay package was dictated by Musk and was the product of sham negotiations with the directors who were not independent of Musk. The order from the Delaware court sent Tesla shares down more than 4% in aftermarket trading. It dealt a big blow to Musk as he seeks billions of dollars of investment for a new artificial intelligence company. The Delaware judge overseeing the case, Kathleen McCormick, said that Musk controlled the board through his personality and influence. This even with just a 22% stake in Tesla. The board could not show the shared grant uh, had been uh, done at a fair price and through fair process. Now, if the ruling is upheld and Musk's remuneration plan is scrapped, he will lose options. Over 303 million Tesla shares, that is close to 10% of the company. It would leave his stake at 13%. It is well below his goal of 25% ownership. And this could also endanger Musk's position as the world's, uh, one of the world's richest men. At the start of this year, Forbes said that he has a fortune of $251 billion. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the updates on the move.